infantry commanders, there's no companies in the in, uh, in situation. Why? I shot there from the uh, KTU side to. Uh, he was trying to put that, put out my uh, KT with howitzer barrages, but it's not gonna work because I got my KT out of there. I have to retreat more grenadiers. They are alone, out alone in the field against some hordes of riflemen, as uh, my opponent is. This is actually blogging a bit. Oh, look at those shots from the Koreans. Oh, the, 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 K, the KT almost died from that volley of uh, AT gun shots there. So that was a bit lucky for me. That he didn't die. Because uh, if he if he would have died, I can't get another one. I didn't decided to uh, get that command point yet. I tried to focus on other stuff like uh, getting my seal ability better and my V1. More creeping traps. My pioneers in the left there died when I think it was another camel shit. <laughs> and camel shit usage. I don't really like the camel as you might have noticed in my previous videos if you watched any of them. I hope they fix it in some way. And for that matter, I don't like MG items either. The MG buffs, the damage buffs you get from, uh, which you can buy from the store and uh, get from the drops. They are too powerful and you need to be taken care of in some way. You can see here if the AT gun goes down to the passage track. Nope, he's gonna survive. And now my opponent has a lot of riflemen. Really a lot. And luckily I have my HMG, my father and my HMG team over here suppressing the hell out of the super squads. So I can finally recap those points. Ooh, that's a hit he got with that one. Ooh, pick up the pick up the Shrek. You don't want Shreks lying around in the battlefield for your opponents to pick up. That's very bad. If they if the rifleman manages to capture a Panzer Shrek. Because sticky bombs and Panzer Shreks from a vet 3 rifle squad is very effective. If you haven't used one of those yet, you should try and preserve your rifle rifleman a bit better so you could get one of those beasts because they are really beasts. They annihilate everything that you can see. <laughs> so, uh, stop it from the microphone. Maybe. Managed to kill my Kuma. Okay, lots of stuff going on at the moment. Keep my um, left uh, victory point well defended by my MG. And finally, my KT is fully repaired and he's once again gonna go into the hell. I'm not gonna take another sip of water here because this is a very long game. 58 minutes. So. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. Ah, those riflemen nearly managed to throw down and nade on my troops there, but they decided to retreat instead. 
which was probably the smartest move in that situation over there. Um, now my new dwarf is gonna fire once again. Shouldn't pop in my, my squad into that house because I know he got um, it's uh, pretty stupid, I guess. Now my KT is gonna say hello to those KT guys. And once again, he's trying to. Harass my southern, southern left to my victory uh, point. That we is kind of a once again. I'm uh, backing up my <laughs> King Tiger here pretty good because he is exactly out of range from sticking it. Um, it's slow like a turtle. And, uh, He's, he, did, he didn't even manage to get a single stick out on it. There's two AT guns in there in the north. Just trying to shoot my. snack my uh, Fodland Age and U team. And they are gonna get blasted away from my Nibu Werfer. That problem and agent you can do a lot of damage. But he, he does need to be treated. Oh, he actually died. Oh, we have more uh, cloaked riflemen. They're gonna take a lot of damage there because I focus firing. I am focus firing with my good uh, swing deers and green deers. They were on low health and I went to kill low health squads instead of they were shooting at full health squads, which take a longer time to kill. Sloppy here, sloppy micro here from, again from my uh, um, <laughs> Look at this V1, it's going down. So in the middle. Oh, he's retreating in the path of the V1. Look at this. Boom! <laughs> so much green speed over there. That was quite a relief for me, as I knew now this game can continue to. Go on because she was getting too much riflemen for me to handle. I'm gonna try and flank this in the two down in the northeast here. It's probably gonna go down. No, the AT again actually misses. Okay. <coughs> Should activate my seal ability. What am I doing? Taking out the almost taking out swap and I got that. But, you know, now I decided to activate seal. That was quite late. Should have done it earlier. And I still haven't upgraded my in, uh, my medic bunker as I was building in the. Um, Southeast by my viewpoint. Sniping another AT gun. I'm gonna try and kill the wreck here, I think. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. You could always try and kill the wrecks of the weapon teams with uh, using uh, Shreks or even Pumas. You can uh, attack, move. And uh, select the select the the wreck and 
your squads are gonna fire at it and they like they are gonna have a nice uh, accuracy bonus instead of using attack ground which is another way to do it but it's very it's much slower to use attack ground uh, than using attack move for some reason I discovered this quite late in my UH career or whatever you call it so now I know how to kill unmanned weapon squad and weapon, unmanned <laughs> weapon teams properly oh another AT on sniped well, that was quite a weird grenade going out there you can see those uh, AT guns are they are in very low health and I'm gonna snipe the hell out of them hell out of them another AT gun died there and another one is probably gonna die here oh maybe not I should really treat those grenades <laughs> and I sniped three AT guns here in the in a time range of 30 seconds so <laughs> quite a effective 30 seconds for me there I guess oh he's killing my poor medics so you should stop with those war crimes sir that's not okay you should instead <laughs> put the artillery on my medic station as I put a V1 rocket at, at the war medic station. Okay, well, now my King Tiger is finally fully repaired again. Oh, my 4MG on the left got grenaded <laughs> to death by those cloaked riflemen. He finally managed to to actually kill the <laughs> to kill the squad behind the MG there on the left. So, nothing much going on at the moment. More uh, needle fire. You can't, you can't have enough needle fire. <coughs> when the uh, reach, when the cooldown is finished, for the needle works, just fire away. It's free to fire, so just go ahead and do it. We always hit something, as you can see. I hit some uh, T-Dents and rifle right over in the north. Four Pumas out in the field now. They can actually go he head to head with AT guns now and take a cruise out. No problem here. Oh, we managed to retreat that in AT gun and go into his base or something. For some healing and such. He's trying to art in my, <laughs> my vehicles, but that is not gonna work. I actually almost killed one of my Kumas, but I am aware of artillery and I know how to get my groups and stuff away. Oh, I actually found another Puma there alone out in the field getting. Even more veterans on my crew must say are at full vet three veterans here right now. Oh, I only have four things. But uh, my vehicles, they are gonna be very powerful now with veterans level three. Horse of riflemen coming in. Look at that five five squads of riflemen. Oh, yeah, no six. No, oh, it's five. Well, whatever. There's a lot of five more in the middle, at the middle VP area. <laughs> I'm um, undecided what my next unit from my tier 3 building is gonna be. And I decide to. Why well, have I have not killed another new worker? They are twice as effective when they are two of them. Of my females living by, they are <laughs> at 5% health and they managed to get out in time. 
a lot of hurt and uh, vehicles on my part and I gotta um, retreat my vehicles and repair them. Got uh, I got I got my um, repair bunker up and uh, some pioneers gonna help out and repair those vehicles up for help. Ooh, AT guns sniping my Fox Grandiers, that is not nice. You are gonna get nibbled, I want you. And now, second nibble out in field. And now, uh, I also decide to get some veteran suit on my nibbles. Ooh. Camera drivers wanted to check out how my base is looking, but they walk into a trap. They walk straight into a mine. Oh, my poor Grandiers got killed on the retreat path. Was unlucky there. You can't always retreat units in time, even if you want. If even if you retreat when they are. While there are two or three men left, they could still die by bar fire from close range while they are ch chasing down the infantry. I really want to cap that um, <laughs> victory point in the middle of me, and the poor Woodsunder is probably gonna die and uh, retreat. No, he has actually survived. And shit, the I really, I really should have gone for a tier four now. I think I have so much fuel, and uh, I mean, Ostwins would have been a great addition to these forces I've got here, and maybe even a single sniper to pick out those. Cruise of the Italians. But once again, he has a camel, so he, he could always snap my. I, I don't. I probably shouldn't say snipe my sniper because you don't. Because camel doesn't snipe. <laughs> oh, we got Shermans out now. I'm trying to. Micro away my poor Primus. <laughs> crew of that uh, Italian uh, died in Puma fire, I guess. And my, my KT is putting a hurt on those riflemen. He is up to 26 kills now. And my medics are actually picking up quite a few. But so I don't know if I have how many of these squads I got. I think one so far, but they are gonna have one more pretty soon. So I'm stopping Mike from here. I should have really grenaded this uh, rifleman instead of just walking straight into him. Oh, microwave Primus, they are taking fire. More me workers on the <laughs> on the on his base. You can see now I'm pretty far behind on victory points. No, I'm actually ahead of him, but he's putting uh, pressure on me. He's controlling two of my two of the victory points on the field, and uh, I need to take control of them to get some pressure on him. My uh, needle worker there was actually bugged. So I decided to move him a bit forward and then try to fire once again. You can see here I decided also to get flame pioneers because <laughs> there was just too many riflemen and Primus versus AT guns aren't that good. So why not flame pioneers? Here we're gonna test them out in battle. We should probably get veterans level 3. Oh, there we go. 
so they got the, got the heat armor they need to counter Rifleman spam or Rifleman in general properly. Constant through <laughs> barraging here from the Weebles, that's very. You should always try to do that, as I said earlier, also. I can cap now with my primers, also. Oh. Upgraded the Sherman with. Uh... Oh, he, also... he got the 76mm upgrade, actually. Ooh, even more artillery going down now. Why not go for a full on assault against the, the lone uh, AT gun over there? Look at that. Squad, that squad picked up a shrek there and so we're down here. Was trying to capture that victory points. Is he gonna? Yeah, he died before he captured the whole thing. So that was a mistake. On <laughs> more, more pumas going down from from the AT gun fire. I don't know how much pumas I lost this game, but you can always build more pumas. This uh, combination with Pumas and uh, Needwarp is, is very effective against this turtling uh, with AT guns, as he's trying to do. You can see, uh, you can see that it is not very effective against against my strategy with our uh, Needwarp. I killed uh, <laughs> so many AT guns in this game. Getting uh, now veterans level 3 for my infantry forces here. I'm gonna take another sip of water. Meanwhile, you can watch the action here in the middle. He's trying to cap the middle VP <laughs> quite desperately, but uh, my Pumas uh, and KT is defending it quite nicely. Ooh, very nice hit on that AT gun. They die from the uh, the after shock or from the flames, which uh, needle workers do uh, my opponent is asking what my level is and it's responding to my current level is 20 for my terror commander and i don't know what why he wondered what my level is should we? yeah i retreat in time for the a T gun, I mean the grenade dodge. My Pumas once again have free range, and I forgot that Panzer Shrek was lying around in the field there. <laughs> so I finally picked that up. Oh, he's losing um, almost two squad in the left while I harass in the Northeast with my with my forces. More uh, weapon coming in though. And I had to retreat from the west. But I got a very stable front here. I, I'm putting him in his base. I should probably get some AT guns to counter counter those I mean packs to counter those uh, Germans more efficiently instead of just using uh, grenadiers with Shreks and 
by KT because Pumas aren't that effective against Shermans. As you know, they are heavily armored and Puma Fire doesn't penetrate if they don't get the upgrade for 75 munitions, which, which I don't really like to upgrade. <clears throat> so, more uh, Nibelwerfers on those. Those uh, Shermans. He is scared of, of my <laughs> new works actually. He uh, is uh, constantly backing, backing those Shermans away from the fire. And the cooldown now on the new workers are very low. Oh, here we go. The, we got a GG from Undefeated. He says that I got a capital victory from this. Um, this game is almost over now. And whew, what a long game. I'm tired and my throat is. Well, it's not burning up, but it's not very. very uh, clear at the moment. So now I'm. I'm just gonna hold my territory here and um, move out my packs and just barrage him some more. He all he already said GG, so this is just some fooling around here from both of us. So you can just watch the action as it progresses. While the victory points is ticking down, it's down to 40 at the moment, so the game is almost over. You can see, see how much craters there are on the field in the middle. There's, yeah, the, the needle fire is, <laughs> is creating a lot of those craters. He's doing some crazy. Base rape stunt here in the end of the game. And I wanted to throw down a one more V1. But it didn't actually get thrown down, so I'm gonna watch the Shamans over here. Let's see if they can kill some tanks. <laughs> like, yeah. Now the game is over, and uh, I am not gonna talk anymore. You can just watch the the score there: 314 kills for me, and that is the game. I hope you enjoyed this game.